Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Please subscribe and keep watching more details. General Hospital Spoilers for Wednesday, September 25. Sam reaches out for help. Plus, Sidwell set a trap. General Hospital, GH, Spoilers for Wednesday, September 25, reveal Sam McCall, Kelly Monaco. Once Carly Spencer's, Laura Wright, help. Meanwhile, Molly Lansing Davis, Kristen Vaginos, wants a word with Martin Gray, Michael E. Knight. Plus, the search for Lucky Spencer, Jonathan Jackson, continues. First, General Hospital spoilers reveal Sam visits Carly. She wants Carly to help her save Alexis Davis, Nancy Lee Gron. Since Carly isn't an expert diver like Sam, We've lost hope of the writers actually remembering that no diver worth their training would ever do a dive alone. There's another angle here. From what's out there, it sounds like this will more be a confrontation. See, basically, everyone knows Sonny Corinthos, Morris Bernard, is the guilty party. So Sam will want Carly to come clean and stop this train wreck Alexis is heading for. Personally, we think she's wasting her time. Carly is already so deep in this thing, she won't reveal she lied about being with Sonny at the time. Not with Diane Miller, Carolyn Hennessy, on her case about appearances and the charges Carly would face. Elsewhere, Molly meets with Martin. Obviously, Molly is invested in helping her mother as much as possible. We also know she's suspicious of Christina Corinthos Davis, Kate Mancy, so we believe she'll make sure Martin is fully aware they were looking for Christina that night. Which, of course, Martin already knows. So this should be interesting to see how he handles that, as he's bound by privilege. If she can't get anywhere on the Christina front, it's a sure thing she'll focus on Sonny's obvious guilt. Which is something she and Martin could collaborate on. Assuming, of course, Alexis allows him to go that way. We're not 100% convinced she will. Finally, General Hospital spoilers reveal Jen Sidwell, Carlo Rhoda, makes a high-stakes offer. He's obviously already aware his guests are hiding something. So we smell a trap waiting to spring on Anna Devane, Fanola Hughes, and Jason Morgan, Steve Burton. And he's pretty confident in dealing with them. In the promo, he says this might be his lucky day. We all know they're going to get out of this with lucky, safe, and sound. So it should be interesting to see how they pull it off. They'll need some luck of their own, given Sidwell is forewarned. On Wednesday, September 25, General Hospital is set to deliver a gripping episode where secrets come to light, trust is tested, and the stakes skyrocket. As Port Charles buzzes with tension, the dynamics between key characters shift in ways that no one sees coming. Sam reaches out for help. Sam McCall, Kelly Monaco, has always been known for her independence and resourcefulness, but even the strongest people need help sometimes. As her world continues to spiral, she finds herself at a crossroads, burdened with a secret that threatens not only her well-being, but the safety of those she loves. Sam's dilemma stems from the mysterious disappearance of Drew Kane, Cameron Matheson, her ex, and the father of her daughter Scout. Recent developments have linked Drew's vanishing to the murky underworld of Port Charles, and Sam can't shake the feeling that something far bigger and more dangerous is at play. Though she's always preferred to go it alone, the weight of Drew's possible peril pushes her to seek help. The unexpected choice she makes, however, could surprise viewers. She turns to none other than Dante Falconeri, Dominic Zampragna. The two share a complicated history, and Sam knows that asking for Dante's help might reopen old wounds. Yet, the stakes are too high for her to ignore. When she reaches out, it's with the intent of diving deeper into Drew's whereabouts, but there's also the unspoken tension between them both professional and personal. Dunt, still reeling from his own struggles, finds it difficult to refuse Sam. They both know this isn't just about Drew, 
there's something bigger lurking in the shadows. And even though their romantic past adds an undercurrent of complexity to their partnership, they share a sense of urgency. For Sam, every passing moment feels like another thread slipping from her control. But what she doesn't know is that seeking help from Dante will place them both squarely in the crosshairs of a looming threat. Sidwell sets a trap. Meanwhile, Gregory Sidwell, Mark Pinter, has been quietly working behind the scenes in ways that will have far-reaching implications. Sidwell is a man of precision, always three steps ahead. And in this particular situation, he's laid out an elaborate trap that no one in Port Charles can see coming. Sidwell's latest target, Michael Corinthos, Chad Dell, and Sonny Corinthos, Morris Bernard. The Corinthos family, with their fingers in both legal and illegal pies, has always been a force to be reckoned with, but Sidwell believes their influence can be toppled. With insider knowledge of Sonny's operations, Sidwell has devised a plan so meticulous that even Sonny, with his vast network of informants, has failed to detect the danger. Sidwell's trap isn't just about money or power, it's personal. Over the years, he's watched the Corinthos family rise to prominence, and while he's kept his cards close to his chest, the day of reckoning has finally arrived. It's a chess game, and Sidwell believes he holds all the crucial pieces. Sidwell's key pawn in his game is none other than Carly Spencer, Laura Wright, who unknowingly steps into the crosshairs. As Carly moves through her day, blissfully unaware of the machinations around her, she's about to find herself caught in a web of deceit. What Sidwell has planned for Carly could either pull the rug out from under her feet or push her into a position of power she's never experienced before. But what Sidwell doesn't know is that Carly's intuition has always been sharp. Even in the throes of personal chaos, she has a knack for sensing when something isn't right. As the trap begins to spring into motion, Carly might just realize the extent of the danger before it's too late, though how she'll respond could spell either her salvation or her downfall. Tension builds across Port Charles. Elsewhere in town, the drama unfolds in other corners of Port Charles, setting the stage for even bigger revelations. Curtis Ashford, Donald Turner, finds himself embroiled in a moral dilemma that threatens to jeopardize his relationship with Jordan, Tanisha Harper. After recent events surrounding the mob's resurgence in Port Charles, Curtis is torn between his loyalty to law enforcement and his growing connections to the darker elements of the city. The lines between right and wrong blur, leaving him questioning his place in a town where survival often depends on how well one can navigate the gray areas. Jordan, who's been suspicious of Curtis' actions lately, senses that something is off. Their marriage, already fragile from previous betrayals, faces another significant test. Curtis wants to protect her from the realities of his situation, but secrets have a way of bubbling to the surface. Will Curtis come clean before it's too late? Or will Jordan be forced to uncover the truth on her own? Meanwhile, T.J. Ashford, Taj Bellow, stumbles upon a piece of information that could tie into Drew's disappearance and Sam's quest for answers. As T.J. works through the clues, he finds himself drawn deeper into the mystery. His medical expertise could prove crucial in uncovering the truth behind Drew's situation but what T.G. uncovers may be more dangerous than he ever anticipated. At the same time, Anna Devane, Fanola Hughes, continues her investigation into Victor Cassidine's lingering influence over Port Charles. Even after Victor's apparent death, Anna remains convinced that the Cassidine legacy of chaos is far from over. As she digs deeper, she comes across an unsettling piece of evidence that suggests Sidwell might have more ties to the Cassidines than anyone realizes. The episode's cliffhanger. As the episode builds to its climax, viewers will be left hanging on the edge of their seats. 
Sam and Dante's alliance takes a dark turn when they find themselves ambushed by unknown assailants, forcing them to question just how deep this conspiracy goes. At the same time, Carly receives an anonymous tip that could either save her life or throw her deeper into Sidwell's trap. Sidwell's plot begins to come into focus, but as with any plan, there are unforeseen variables. And in true General Hospital fashion, not everything will go according to Sidwell's design. As the clock ticks down, one wrong move could change the course of the Corinthos Empire forever. With tension, betrayal, and unexpected twists at every turn, Wednesday's episode promises to set the stage for even greater chaos in the weeks to come. The trap is set. Now it's only a matter of time before it snaps shut.